What is going on guys welcome back to another video i hope you're having an amazing day and today's video we're going to taking a look at how you can get now brief working on older samsung devices so if you don't already know now brief is a galaxy s25 exclusive feature until samsung's one year 8 leaked builds for the older devices like samsung z fold 6 so currently one year 8 is now officially in beta for the galaxy s25 so samsung is updating a lot of apps for it and few of the apps are being leaked so just one of them the app that carries no brief is now completely working on the S24 and S23 as if right now confirmed but you can also check it on the S21 and S22 if it does work please let me know in the comment section below but now let's just check it out how you can install it so no brief is part of Samsung smart suggestions app so if you just update it right away to this specific version you will have no brief completely working fine so let's just go to widgets you will have now brief right up top if the personal data intelligence app just crashes just go to storage clear data go back and i'm talking about this specific version 7.0.06.0 as samsung might remove it and keep it exclusive for one you add so until then if you want to just check it out this is the only way so let's just add the widget again it should be right over here just like that tap on it good evening Deva. thanks for that start the now brief and as you can see it has already made a weekly report playlist that i might enjoy and few of the stuff like how much i use my phone while walking but all this ai stuff is separately to activate so if you just install the now brief like this you will have a blank page and you can just check out the ui and stuff there won't be all of that and the now brief working on the lock screen which is also possible in this version so for that you will need two apps shizuku and system your toner so first of all let's just set up shizuku go to pairing allow notifications just like that go to developer options if you haven't already enabled them just go to software information tap on build number 9 to 10 times and it should enable it so go to wireless debugging turn that on go to pair device with pairing code and just remember this number 012595 whatever that be 012595 send it pairing successful number varies on your device so going back just start and now you have a complete adb server working on your phone so this method doesn't need a pc going back system ui tuner let's just set this up scrolling down let's just agree its permissions Grant secure settings. Grant all the rest of the permissions. Allow notifications. Crash report, none needed. And let's just open the app. Scrolling down, go to system lock screen lock screen shortcuts let's just edit the left one you have to search for personal data intelligence just like that and now it's the tricky part you have to search for developer mode developer mode activity screenshot this you have to find this activity right over here which would be ending with developer mode activity just click on that hit ok and now if you lock the phone will have that shortcut right over here so let's just unlock it enable scrolling down you will find something called enable personal data engine just enable this and now this will allow the nerve brief to accumulate all the on device ai for it to give suggestions about your day and all the extra stuff and yeah guys that's pretty much it on how you can enable now brief on older devices i hope you guys enjoyed if you found this helpful Please drop a like and if you want more videos like this, please let me know in the comment section below and see you guys in the next one.